Yo, what's going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another video here on Akuma MC Skyblock and in this video we're going to be expanding some of our farms and improving them a ton so stay tuned to the very end. Currently we have this blaze spawners right here. We don't really have a farm for it right now. We're just basically killing them once they spawn but we can definitely make that more efficient so we're going to be doing that. Then we also have this little fire thing kind of happening here. It's not that efficient and I'm pretty sure the chests are full so we're going to have to sell those a little bit later and basically the mobs just drop to the lava which go into the chunk hopper up here and have a little chest system so yeah we're definitely going to have to help expand that too and just make it way more efficient with fire scrolls and stuff like that and then we have this wheat farm which i did expand it all the way to the end but we should make more rows and stuff so so we it will be more efficient and i do want to go ahead and mine a row of this i do kind of want to see if it utilizes gems we can see we have 31k basically what you can do with gems so if you go into the slash shop and go to the gem shop you can buy all these satchels garden spawners and some of these scrolls and the main one we're going for is fire scrolls because they basically set the mob on fire so you don't have to go and put lava down and it's just gonna be way way faster and more efficient and then so let's go ahead and see how much all this all this wheat and gems stuff we're gonna make me so we're at 3.165 gems so let's go ahead and mine oh, both of these rows and hopefully we're gonna get a good amount of wheat i don't really know if there's an optimal way it's probably if it probably could mine the wheat like this yeah this way looks pretty pretty fast pretty decent so we're gonna go ahead and mine both of these rows and let's see how much wheat we i mean gems we can actually get and i think we're not auto collecting so we're gonna go pick up the wheat too after we are done mining them and see how much it will sell for it's probably not a lot but it probably will make us a decent a decent amount i don't really know money is money right now we will take anything we could get and okay let me just clean it up real quick and they get a farming skill level up which is definitely going to be pretty useful let me check my skills actually if we're going to slash skills you can see with the farming skill we did get to level six and on level five we got a three percent crop drop boost which is pretty good 20 cloud keys and a five x chicken spawner and the next one we're going to get an eight percent crop drop a boost 48 cloud keys and 10x cow spawners and we do have a pretty good amount of keys right now they did a crate key all which they do every now and then so make sure to log on for those but okay let's go ahead and sell all this so slash sell all that was 15k there and let's go ahead and sell the satchel and okay that was zero i guess i guess i already sold it but okay that's not bad that's not bad and then let's go ahead and i do want to go ahead and sell these this chest oh wait no let's check my gems so these slash gems we're at 32.47k so we jumped up about 800 I, I would say so which is not bad at all for that that little farm that we do have and okay let's go ahead and sell this stuff and okay i'm probably going to remove this island part like the bottom right here just so we could easily access the chest a little bit better but let's go ahead and sell it i do have like a little crop like malfunction here because we don't currently have if you go into the ice perks we don't have the copper limit upgraded right now right now we only have 40 limit and we did use all of that so we needed to kill 10,000 mobs which is kind of insane we're at 2,000 out of 10,000 so yeah it's gonna definitely take some time but let's go ahead and sell all of these um i'm just gonna go like this i guess i don't know um i'm making a decent bit actually per chest i'm just gonna keep selling can't reach the one all the way over there but yeah this is gonna make us a decent bit of money i mean we're definitely going to get more once we do expand it and get responders and stuff like that but yeah this is just it for now and yeah we're gonna have to definitely make it better and make a new grinder for this blazes so we do have some keys so let's go ahead and open up those in these slash crates so if we go there real quick and let's see 422 cloud keys okay that's kind of insane 200 storm keys and 115 tempest keys okay that is actually a crazy amount of keys so i'm going to set up a new something new chest because i did run out of the storage and if we go to the miscellaneous right here let's just do another double chest and i'm going to empty out my inventory because we need all our inventory for these crates because we just have a whole bunch okay now i'm gonna go to the crates and see so we have 400 i'm just gonna open till my inventory is full okay oh i definitely sold the chest okay so we got a whole bunch of cell ones i don't know if there's a way to merge let me check yeah i don't know if there's a way to merge cell ones or what but yeah we just get a whole bunch of those and chunk hoppers that's mainly the things we get i mean we could probably filter them in the key rewards but we're just gonna hold off on that for now and we got two more ranks okay not bad we do have a little bit of collection of ranks going actually okay three value tickets we'll take that 17.5 key value some more spawners okay we're gonna hold on to these spawners because that's gonna help be helpful to our farm and okay so let's go back to the crate and we still have 300 okay this might take a bit i might have to cut and come back i don't really know yet uh, i might have to also filter these cell ones because we're just getting a whole bunch oh, an xp pouch okay we're gonna take the xp pouch because we do really need xp so more keys yeah i'm probably gonna cut and filter out these rewards and i'll be back okay we are done opening all of the crate keys we got some insane stuff we got some value tickets here that i did claim that got us about like 350k thousand island value so we're gonna take that 
we have all of these bonds we're going to do we're going to put into our farm which are going to be very very helpful and we have all these pouches we have a mining robot which we're definitely going to take i think it's the first one we've gotten two normal pets and let's see we got 44 dungeon keys which isn't bad at all and i think that's basically it let me go ahead and hatch these pet eggs and see if we get any good pets it looks like we got a mana pet and a universal pet um they're honestly look both pretty decent this one just overall helps xp gem skill boost and this one has a chance to increase the enchant proc so both seem pretty good and i'm definitely gonna help use this i'm gonna figure use this money bot too i think if we just place it down i can't mine this block uh okay maybe it's facing the wrong way i really don't know okay i rotate and okay now it's working so link me to a chest okay we need to put okay we're, new, we're definitely gonna set that up later um uh, definitely not our main priority right now but let's go ahead and open all these pouches so we have some xp pouches and some gem pouches and okay these are better xp and we also got this auto cell chest so that's actually very useful i think we could just put it here instead of this big system now let me go ahead and check uh let me get a pickaxe or yeah let me get a pickaxe and break this and let me go see if it auto sells because that's it's honestly gonna be very helpful to us and boom uh, let me put it below it and i think it should be selling now it is gonna fill up pretty fast so i don't know if there's a way to increase the size but it should be definitely very helpful because we don't need this big chest system anymore so yeah we're definitely going to take that we could probably break it but i'm sure to keep it for now Ain't too long to break in this video but yeah we did get all these spawners i'm gonna put into the form and that's just gonna help us a ton we also did get a new spawner the villager spawner 